Hello everyone. Today's question of the day is upon base system. We learn how to convert a number in a specific base to another base by solving a Pascal question. So the question is: In a number system, the product of forty-four and eleven is one zero three four. What will the number three triple one of this system when converted to decimal system become? So the whole point is about converting one base to another over here. So we were given that forty-four is a number in a specific base, eleven in the same base. When they are multiplied, it becomes one zero three four. We do not know the base, so let us assume that the base is x over here. Since for this particular base x, we do not know the conversion rules, so we'll convert both the LHS and RHS into decimal system. Decimal system means base ten. I hope you know how to do that. To convert a number in a specific base system to base ten, for example, if it is one one two three four, if this is in base a, if you convert it to decimal, you will first pick up the unit digit which is four, then you pick up the base, you multiply both of them. Power of a that means the base will always start from zero, then plus sign, then you pick up the next digit which is three. So three into the base again a. Now the power of the base will be increased by one, so it will become one from zero. Then we'll pick up the next digit, which is two. So two into again the power of base will increase by one, so from one it will become two. Then next digit, which is one, so one into a cube. Then next digit, which is one, one into a to the power four. So that is how we convert a number in base a or any base to decimal base decimal base that means 10 so doing the same here 44 in base x will be converted to base 10 so it would become 4x to the power 0 plus 4x to the power 1 which means 4x into this would become 1x to the power 0 plus 1 into x in the rhs will be writing 4x to the power 0 then 3x then 0 into x square would become 0 Then one into x cube. So if we write this properly, we get four x plus four multiplied by x plus one. In the RHS, we'll be getting x cube plus three x plus four. Now, if I simplify the LHS, I'll be getting four x square plus eight x plus four equal to x cube plus three x plus four. Four four would cancel. Ultimately, we'll get x cube minus five x minus four x square equal to zero. If we take x common, then we'll be getting x square minus four x minus five equal to zero. So this x would become zero. Now we have x square minus four x minus five equal to zero. So if we factorize this, we'll be getting x minus five x plus one equal to zero. So we get two values of x, five and minus one. The base can never be a negative number, so this will be removed. X will have value of five. That means the base is five. So now we need to find out if this three triple one in base five is converted to decimal. What will we get? So three triple one was in base five. If we convert this to decimal, we'll be getting one into the five to the power zero plus one into five to the power one plus one into Five square plus three into five cube. So this would give me one plus five plus twenty-five plus three into five cube. That means three into one twenty-five, three seventy-five. If you add them all, you will be getting four hundred six as the final answer. So option A is correct over here. This was a pass cat question, but very easy. If you have any doubt, please comment. Thank you for listening.